Audubon visited the Lehigh Gorge in 1829 and spent over a month painting images of the birds in the area. At this time, the gorge was largely untouched by human hands, but Audubon could see that that situation was not going to last. Lumber was in such high demand during the mid to late 1800s that much of Pennsylvania's forests were struck bare. The Lehigh Gorge was no exception. Its old growth forests of white pine and hemlock were harvested and sent down the Lehigh River. The wood was used for lumber and the park was used in tanneries for making lumber. The Lehigh Gorge State Park is 4,548 acres in Luzerne and Carbon counties. Hunting and fishing are permitted in the park. Popular game includes rough grass, squirrels, turkey, white-tailed deer, black bear, and rabbits. The Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission ensures that anglers will have plenty of chances to catch fish by stocking trout in the waters of the Lehigh River.
the staff of the Lehigh Board of Senior Railway, we'd like to thank you for riding with us today. Please exit the train only when there's an open door and step box with a uniform car host present. And remember to hold on to the yellow handrails and watch your step. If you've accumulated trash on the train, please take it with you and deposit it in the trash cans in the vestibule that are there for that purpose. Check around your seating area and make sure that you drop nothing personal that you may need on your way home. Like your car keys. So check around and also check the luggage racks to make sure you don't dump it up there. Have a great day and enjoy the many other attractions that you'll have to jump for as well. Ready for the trip, return trip.